Okay. So I'm basically gonna try and record every time I do my makeup. So I have. I'm hoping that it'll give me inspiration. I'm literally yelling over this music. So today I'm basically getting ready, and I'm gonna be talking to y'all like guess. So I'm gonna zoom y'all in, and we're gonna get started on this face. Well, the eyebrows. So I need a sharpener, but of course, every time I need it, I can't find it. Prime my eyes with the CoverGirl True Blend Undercover Concealer in shade Buff Beige. And I'm gonna use like a really, really baby beauty blender because they're so cute. I'm gonna use that to just blend that out on the eye. I kind of feel like I should use the Jackie Anna palette. So I'm going to. I'm going to take my JH30 brush and use the shade Credit and put that on the outer corner. I don't know if I said it, but I'm using the uh, shade Credit. Oh my god, that rhyme. I should make music on the outer corner. And then I wanna take just this, I have like a rag that I'm using as like my wiper, whatever. I wanna take the shade Ginger and kind of add that to the crease in front after adding credit to kind of give like a transition because I wanna use more than like two shades right now, you know. I like that transition between the two. I think that's pretty. Wow, I like that transition between the two a lot. Almost a year later, or about a year later, and I have yet to take off the freaking plastic off of the mirror. Here we go. This is a good mirror to use. It's a great size. Cute. So I'm gonna take the shade Soleil, and I'm gonna put that on as like my crease shade. My crease shade. On my like lid, sorry. This is the perfect brush for this. Oh my gosh. This is the JH42 brush from the Morphe X Jaclyn Hill collection. This is the perfect type of brush for this. So, I guess as you can tell by the title, because I don't know what I'm titling this, but I think I have an idea. It's basically technically like my graduation day. I um, finished my classes, and for my school, summer doesn't really have a graduation. So, this is the day where like grades are basically due and done. So, I'm considering it my graduation day. Um, so, yeah, I took my graduation pictures like a week or so ago with my best friend because his graduation day was like a few days ago like last week so and mine is today basically so it's kind of crazy it's actually really crazy um <laughs> i'm gonna use my elf poreless putty primer but, you know, hmm. I feel like when we go into college, well, at least for me, I'm not gonna speak for everybody else, but like, you have like this goal. You're like, okay, I graduated this year from high school. So, you know, in four years, you know, I'm gonna have my bachelor's degree. And, you know, going through the process of just college and life, <laughs> um, experiencing like real life things, I've come to realize that that is just 
not the case always. I'm taking the CoverGirl True Blend um, foundation in shade T10. You know, life hits you sometimes, and at the most like unexpected moments, and so you know, obviously, some a lot of the times, things we're not really prepared for. Um, but we go through them and we get through them because we're strong. Um, so it's kind of crazy how it's like, I feel like towards like my last years of high school, like my last two years and then, you know, college for me this whole entire time for the past about almost three years now, um, has been just very like eye opening, you know, and pertains to just like in regards to life. I have just, I don't know, I've just experienced, I feel like, more real life situations that I had before. And it kind of put so many things into perspective for me. Um, so, I don't know. It's just crazy. Like, ever since college started for me, it's just been like, I feel like it's just been like a constant battle, almost, personally. And... I pushed through it and it's crazy to me because at a point in time I thought that I wasn't gonna be able to push through it but I did and here I am graduating with my degree to kind of like show that like for me you know me earning my first degree because this is just the first of more that I want to do um, but you know for me it's just like it kind of shows how life threw a lot of curveballs at me but I kept going and I had a goal and I knew what I wanted to do in life and I knew that, you know, certain things were just temporary and that I needed to continue in this time in order to get to like my end goal. And I feel like I'm literally walking like proof of that. Um, ew, my voice cracked. I'm taking the same, the CoverGirl True Blend Concealer in shade Buff Beige, the one that I used in my eye. And uh, it's just kind of crazy. I never, I was put in situations that I never thought that I would really be in. And to have been through them and got through them and then be right here right now saying how I've, you know, kind of conquered that and finished that part of my life. It's, um, it's, it feels rewarding almost. I'm just thankful to God that I'm just here and that I'm in the position that I'm in and, and able to do the things that I love and able to be around the people that I love and have the people that I have in my life, you know. Um, life throws curveballs, man. But I don't know, I proved myself wrong. I would always create situations in my head and, you know, when some of them like came to light and actually were like going on I was just like oh my god like how am I gonna get through this I used to just like be like oh my god I don't know how I would ever get through this and now here I am basically on the other side of it and I finished my degree I've you know kind of built my channel to where I want it to be for now like at the goal that I like set for myself for this year so far and um, even though I'm not done of course and you know it's quite I don't know I just have a lot to be thankful for I'm using the LA girl pro conceal in shade chestnut to contour cream contour I don't know and regardless of what degree you're getting I don't think college is easy you know it's like yeah, you have courses that you may find easier, but not everybody is going to find them easy, you know. So anybody I think who has completed anything, whether it's just your associates, your bachelor's, master's, doctorates, um, you're getting just certified in something, I think that you're doing amazing. I mean, some people, I don't know. It's not as easy as you think it is just to go to a school for just two years and to be like, oh yeah, I just took basic classes and got a degree. It's like, it's much different from high school. And obviously, I mean, it's college. It's a whole different, you know, realm of schooling. Um, and plus, you know, as we get older, you know, different life things start to come along. So um, adding that on top of, you know, 
you being personally accountable for your work and everything. I mean, if you've gotten through it and you're getting through it right now, and even if you're struggling right now, you're gonna get through it. And um, you should just be proud of yourself for you to sit there and be in the moment and to have even enrolled in your courses, to have finished your courses if you have, to be finishing up your courses, to even be thinking about it. See, for me, I was in such a place where I was like, you know what, I'm probably never gonna go back, at least not right now, you know, I was just so focused on other things, and then literally one day came, and I was like, you know, I think I wanna go back and like finish because I had one semester left. I, was, I had a few credits left, and you know, I spent that day doing my research on making sure I was like putting the right classes on my schedule because none of my academic advisors at all were getting back to me and really helping me out. And I figured it out on my own. I finished it 100% and here I am now graduating. So um, it's possible. So just believe in yourself because it's, it's really possible. It's, it's, it's possible. I don't know. It's crazy to see my growth in these past three years. If you've known me, getting at my really close friends and people that I was once close with, but you know we've grown apart. Like I feel like they can like all attest to like the craziness and things that have gone on in my life in the past like three years, just about. So, um, and I'm thankful for everybody, whether they're in my life right now or not. to do something different so I'm gonna take the shade you're kidding from the James Charles palette and just kind of add that to the bottom lash line that's cool I like that I like that I like that for that too this is the Morphe X Jaclyn Hill J43 brush I really use these brushes a lot. Um, they're really my favorites, to be honest with you. Oh, I'm loving this. I really like the way this eye looks. I don't think I'm gonna put lashes on because I was supposed to film a video where I try them out and I don't wanna like, cheat that so i'm gonna probably film that maybe later or maybe after this but i kind of want to leave it like this for now i don't know what to do for my lips because i fell in love with like brown lipstick again last night but i don't know if i want to do that today should i eh, f it we'll try it if we don't like it i'll add something in the middle and we'll see how that goes so i'm gonna use the mac matte Antique Velvet um, Brown Lipstick. Love this. This is one of my. This is, if not my favorite brown lipstick, one of my favorites. So. I actually really like this. I literally wore brown lipstick last night and I fell in love. So here we are. So creamy, but it stays on. Imagine. Okay, so I'm gonna go do my hair and I'm gonna come back and show you guys my finished 
look but this is the makeup so i'll be right back with the finished hair okay guys so that is it for this makeup um i really like it i really want to add highlighters to my collarbone just because i'm extra but yeah that is it for this makeup i'm gonna just be celebrating myself today and just taking a day to just you know kind of self-reflect on everything that i've went through but the outcome is what's greater than all of those things and it's what's made me stronger as a person and as the woman that i am today so yeah today is just my celebratory day to just celebrate myself and celebrate my growth and my health and my well-being and my success and what i've wanted to achieve so thank you guys so much for watching this video congratulations to anybody else who has graduated this year and i will see you guys in my next one don't forget to like this video comment down below and i will see you guys in my next video i don't know what those hand gestures were but i'll see you guys in my next one bye to you.